Karen Brady, 52, has thrown her support behind The Apprentice finalist Catherine Byrne, 29, who said viewers sexualized her for sharing scantily clad photographs on Instagram. Catherine, who came second to Artpreet Kaur in Thursday's Tense finale, said she is allowed to be glamorous and a successful businesswoman at the same time. Catherine fumed, it was like, how dare she be in a bikini and be a businesswoman. People were saying that because we wore bikinis, our business plans must be ST. But I'm allowed to do that as well as work hard and own a business. They sexualized us, she told the son. After seeing Catherine in action throughout this year's series as Lord Alan Sugar's aide, Karen said it was annoying that Catherine's skills were being overshadowed by outdated attitudes. Writing in her column for the aforementioned publication, Karen said both Catherine and Arpreet did brilliantly to make it to the Apprentice final and that they both proved themselves as true businesswomen. She continued, as, Catherine, rightly pointed out, she is allowed to celebrate her glamorous side as well as working hard and owning a company. But Catherine says some viewers seem to have the opinion that she can't pose in a bikini and be a businesswoman, as if it's simply not possible to have both brains and beauty. In fact, the list of women who have both is endless. What an outdated and archaic attitude some people have. And good on Catherine for pointing it out. Catherine took part in the BBC show in a bid to secure Lord Sugar's £250,000 investment for her pajama company, My Everyday Pajamas. But she lost out to Arpreet and her dessert business, Oh So Yum, in the show's first all-female finale. In a new interview with Express.co.uk, Karen hailed the women as remarkable. When asked whether she felt the need to push the ladies' confidence in the boardroom, Karen replied, the one thing they don't lack on The Apprentice is confidence and whether that's sometimes misplaced, that's another question altogether. I think the women on The Apprentice this year have done remarkable and are doing very well. Karen joined the show in 2009 as a replacement for Margaret Mountford. She has sat alongside tough interviewer Claude Littner as well as former winner Tim Campbell when Claude was unable to take part after a cycling injury. The business magnate opened up about the relationship she has with her colleagues behind the scenes. She said, it's a great show to be part of and we all get on really well. You know, in lots of television shows people don't get on particularly well and, in our house, we get on very well, we're very supportive of each other's companies. You look back at the previous winners, they employ hundreds of people, have successful businesses, have independence and realize their dream of being a business owner. We believe in the show and what we're trying to do.